Paul Smith's College is located in the heart of the Adirondack Mountains in upstate New York, not far from the two-time Olympic Village of Lake Placid. It is situated on a 14,000-acre campus and has multiple educational programs such as environmental science and forestry. It has created a Troops to Timber project whose goal is to educate transitioning soldiers on the opportunities at Paul Smith College and programs available to veterans. Professor Brett McLeod is the chair of the Forestry Department at Paul Smith and he provides an overview of why sustainable timber harvesting matters. The students in the School of Logging are really focused on learning the hard skills behind uh, timber management. And so this means they're in the equipment um, all day long, every day, running skidders, log loaders, uh, working on building roads, um, figuring out how to extract value from the forest while also managing it for future generations to come. Sustainability underpins everything we do because if, uh, if what we do out here today isn't thinking about the future, we won't have jobs in the future. So this is really a career that's not just about sort of the products that we're able to put to market in real time today, but also what we put out a generation down the road. We're out here with the Troops to Timber program and the Paul Smith College School of Logging. This is one of our premier programs where we teach hands-on skills in timber harvesting, uh, basic forestry. The students come out here and on day one, they're getting their boots muddy, their hands dirty, and they're doing the real work that it takes to manage a forest. John Robbins is a former Marine who was attracted to what this program had to offer. The School of Logging specifically is like a, it's a two week program and uh, the G, you, know, you can use the GI Bill um, to do it basically for free. Uh, you'll get room and board while you're here. They'll put you in a dorm room and it's just like really intensive hands-on uh, logging certification course. And so um, that's a great option for guys who wanna just do a, a real quick certification to get out in the woods and um, you know get, get going with their career. I, want, I was focusing a little bit more on the academic side, so forestry was my choice. I still ended up doing a lot of the same stuff, but obviously, you know, it's a four-year degree with, you know, graduate opportunities after that. Levi Sisler is one of the teachers of the program here at Paul Smith, and there was more to it, including an emphasis on safety. So I teach the Summer Forest Production Processes course, where we're out here in the woods um, logging. Um, we teach students how to safely get trees on the ground and get them out of the woods to the landing and turn them into logs and how to make the most valuable log we possibly can. So the School of Logging is a more hands-on forestry approach where we're out here in the woods the vast majority of the time logging. Um, we do game of logging level one and two, which is a chainsaw uh, safety training. We do logger rescue so that we understand how to get loggers out of the woods if there would be an injury. We do CPR and first aid, um, and we spend a lot of time out here in the woods practicing getting trees on the ground. We also run the sawmill so that students get experience with that. We talk about dendrology, which is tree identification, so that students know what trees they're looking at when they're out here in the woods. And we generally try to prepare them for their next step, which is hopefully an internship um, with a logging company. Forest mensuration is the science of looking at a tree and understanding what type of volume is there, whether that's weight, cords, board foot volume. Um, so there's different ways we can do that, but we need to know what volume is there because the volume determines what the value is of the tree. Um, so we can measure tree diameter, we can measure tree height, and we can get an idea of what volume is actually contained in that tree. Professor McLeod acknowledges the success of this program at Paul Smith College. We love when students come back and brag about what they've been doing since their time here at Paul Smith's because they end up all over the world. We have students that have gone on to work in Alaska in high lead logging operations, fight wildfires in the West, 
uh, manage their own timber companies in New England. So th it's really a wide range of careers that they go on to that are really impressive. You have to be a sort of a self-made person to become a forester or to work in the woods. No one's there watching over your shoulder and that's one of the best parts of the job, but it also means you have to go out and figure out how to make it happen every day, overcome problems, the weather, you name it, we're here to solve those and, and uh, do good work in the woods. For more information on the Troops to Timber program or forestry at Paul Smith College, go to admissions at paulsmiths.edu.